It is the Texas barbecue burger. It's available only at Carl's Jr. Smoke brisket, cattleman's barbecue sauce, spicy jalapeno straws, onion straws on a charbroiled burger, and uh, only at Carl's Jr. Fresh baked bun there too. The Texas barbecue thick burger. We're giving those away tonight on the Hawk Shop. I can tell you this, the burger's fantastic. The brisket, fantastic. Loved it. Do you want to have barbecue trivia or Texas trivia? Barbecue trivia. Barbecue trivia. We're going to start with number one, make it easy for you. Name one of the three most popular holidays for barbecuing. Just one of them. That's all you got to name. Fourth of July. There you go. Fourth of July. Congratulations. See, that easy to win from Carl's Jr. and the Hawk Shop. I'll send these to you in the mail, okay? All right. Thank you, Dave. You do a great job with your show. Thank you. We appreciate that. Sure. Now, have you ever thought about brisket on a burger before? Brisket on a burger sounds great. It is. I just had one. All right. <laughs> the Texas barbecue burger, it was fantastic. It was, it's a whole meal in itself. It is wonderful. And you can get uh, the onion rings, the onion strips, and the jalapeno strips as a side order with that, too, instead of fries. All right, so what is the Texas State slogan? Lone Star State. Lone Star State, that is correct. Congratulations. What's your first name? What city in Texas is considered the live music capital of the world? you got to do harder than that one. That's at Austin. That's, that's right, Austin. South by Southwest is the big, well, maybe that's a question later on. Maybe I shouldn't say that. Uh, that's right, Austin, Texas. Uh, the longhorn is the official large mammal of Texas. What is the official small mammal of Texas? Oh, I'd have to guess uh, armadillo. <laughs> you are correct. I didn't even give you, I hadn't even got to the choices yet. <laughs> what U.S. president hosted the first barbecue at the White House which featured Texas-style ribs on the menu? Lyndon Johnson. Correct. Congratulations, you are correct. Lyndon Johnson. Someone that has mastered the skill of barbecuing is often called a what? A grill master. Mm, that is incorrect. Oh, you'll find out why if you keep watching the show because we got another trivia question that kind of explains that. You're going to get the same question oh, as Mike no. gets it right. <laughs> Let's see. What's the name of the barbecue master? Let's say that he is a professional barbecuer. No, that is incorrect. Oh, man, I tried. Pit master? That is correct. It is hey. pit master. That's right. Tonight, it's Texas Up on the Hawk Shop. What month is National Barbecue Month? How about August? Mm, that is incorrect. August is not right. You're live on the Hawk Shop. Hi. What can I guess, May? Mm. Mm -hmm. My mouth's full, see? Oh, um, I see that. <laughs> what was it again? May. No. Yes, it is May. That is correct. I've been eating during the break, as you can tell been eating the new Texas barbecue burger. Now on the bottom, it's got a barbecue brisket on the top. It's got cheese. It's also got a, man, even just by handling it, you gotta have a little napkin there. <laughs> I like that. Um, it's got a onion strips, jalapeno strips, some cattleman's barbecue sauce, all on a fresh baked bun. The new Texas barbecue burger, only from Carl's Jr. Which city in Texas is considered to be now, if you get it right, I expect a big reaction, okay? Okay. Okay, which is considered to be a capital of barbecue. I would have to say Lockhart, Texas. Yay. Congratulations! Thank you, sir. Well, that was all? You, you just gave me a thank oh, you, Oh, hey, I won! I actually won. That's awesome. I can't believe it. That's great. <laughs> also want to thank Carl's Jr. We're going to give away more Carl's Jr. next week. Well, time for us to get out of here. Going to go home and watch Big Brother. See you next week.
Yes, you can tell already we have teamed up once again with Carl's Jr. as we give away the Texas barbecue burger. It's got barbecue brisket, also cheese, onion, and jalapeno strips. Like I said, on a thick burger, that's a charbroiled burger and a fresh baked bun. New from Carl's Jr. Missy, you've had you had one last week, correct? I did. You, you told us last week you really like the brisket. Oh yeah, the brisket's awesome. Mm. It's like like I could eat nothing but that and, and be really good. But it's good with the burger and the jalapeno straws. And the thing is, is I'm not a real spicy eating person. Mm -hmm. But they, the jalapeno straws were not overly spicy. They just had really good flavor to them. So I agree. Yeah. I agree. What popular TV show, which originally debuted in 1978, featured the Ewing family who lived on a sprawling South Fork ranch? That would be Dallas. Dallas, that is correct. All Thank right. You. Did you watch Dallas as a kid? I did. See, I, I said as a kid. As a kid, yes. Okay, good, good, good. <laughs> What's your first name? Welcome back to the Hawk Shop. That's right, we've teamed up with Carl's Jr. again. This time to give you a chance to win the Texas Barbecue Burger. That's barbecue brisket on a thick burger. I think one of the things I really like is the little bit of spice that's in it. Just a little bit. It's not overpowering, but I do like the little bit of spice that's in it. That's one of the things I really enjoy about this burger. Now, did you have a chance to, uh, to try one? I did. I went yesterday and, and got one of those Texas uh, burgers. What was it called? Texas Barbecue Burgers, right? Yes, sir. It was good. It was tasty. Yeah? I liked it. You like the jalapeno strips on top? Yeah, I yeah. like the whole thing. It was, it was, it was good. Yeah. Good. He enjoys calling in, and hopefully you enjoy hearing from him. He enjoyed the uh, new Texas barbecue burger from Carl's Jr. slash Hardee's down there. What's not to enjoy? It's a full meal. Yeah, it is. It really is. That's uh, that's this burger right here, folks. That uh, I'm just about done. I can see the brisket right there. I can see the the jalapeno straws, the cheese, the thick burger. Mmm. Excellent, excellent stuff. The saying, don't mess with Texas, actually comes from an anti-littering ad campaign. Is that true or false? <laughs> I'm going to go with false on that. Ooh, you would be wrong. I would be wrong if Ooh. don't mess with Texas. Four five two three six nine seven. Call in right now. You can win from Carl's Jr. Uh, it won't be this burger. We'll send you coupons where you can get your own burger. Mmm. The new Texas barbecue burger from Carl's Jr. Says you want to answer a trivia question, is that correct? Yes, I do. Okay, have you, have you ever eaten a Texas barbecue burger from Carl's Jr.? No, never have. Okay, that was the wrong answer. No, no, hold on. Two cities that claim to have the biggest barbecue cook-offs in the country. Uh, St. Louis and Kansas City. Well, i tell you what, you got one of them right, so I'm going to give you two coupons. I'm not going to tell people which one. Kansas City and Memphis. That is correct. You are correct. Now, if you, uh, you know, Carl's Jr. had the Memphis barbecue burger. Yeah. Now we have the Texas barbecue burger. Have you tried it? Not yet, but I don't think I'm going to real soon. All right. In this list, name who is the famous Texan, okay? Okay. Okay, you ready? It's uh, Matthew McConaughey, Willie Nelson, Renee Zellweger, Owen Wilson, or all of the above? All of the above. I'm saying, say that again? All of the above. That is correct. Kara is very correct. All of them are famous Texans. You got that right. What's your first name? Floyd. Floyd? Yes. Okay, Floyd. Have you tried the new barbecue, Texas barbecue burger from Carl's Jr.? Yes, I have. You have. What did you think about it? Oh, man, it is a delicious sandwich. Cool. And that's why you called in wanting to win some more, right? Another one, yeah, the half pounder. <laughs> <laughs> See, that brings us to the end of our show. I want to thank Carl's Jr. for once again teaming up with the Hawk Shop, bringing you a chance, bringing us the opportunity to present to you the new Texas barbecue burger from Carl's Jr. Don't forget... Folks, this burger has not only barbecue brisket on it, which is just fantastic, Cattleman's barbecue sauce. It also has onion strips, jalapeno strips, cheese on a thick burger with a fresh baked bun. Oh, and then on the side,
for the side, instead of getting french fries or sweet potato fries, which are great, you know, during this time, you ought to get you the onion and jalapeno strips. Those are fantastic. I recommend those highly.